Welcome to Festive Flavors. Today we are going to cook Amritsari Chola. The method of cooking is slightly different from the Chola Masala, but the taste is just out of this world. Amritsari Chola, as the name suggests, is from Amritsar. It has a dark color and distinct flavor due to tea bags and from other spices that go into the making of this flavorful curry. Here is a quick way of making Amritsari Chola in my style. It goes well with Amritsari Kulcha. Please watch the video till the end to view the health benefits of chickpeas, tips and tricks and ingredients list. Also please subscribe to the channel Festive Flavors and hit the bell icon to receive new recipe updates. Please share it with your friends and family. Please click the like button if you like the recipe. Also tell us what you think of this recipe in the comment section below. Did you make this recipe? Show me your creation on Instagram, Twitter and Facebook with tag at sign festive flavors and hash festive flavors. We will feature your picture and name in the upcoming videos. Let's look at the ingredients. Chickpeas 2 cups, grated onion 1 large, tomato 1 large, garlic paste 2 tablespoon, ginger 2 teaspoon, chopped green chilies 5 to 6, mace 1, black pepper 6 to 8, cloves 5 to 6, black and green cardamom 2 each, cinnamon 1 inch piece, cumin seeds half teaspoon, bay leaves 3 to 4, turmeric powder 2 teaspoon, coriander powder 1 tablespoon, armchair powder 3 tablespoons, Kashmiri lal mirch 2 tablespoons, cumin powder 2 teaspoons, tea bags 2, soda 1 4 teaspoon, asafoetida 1 teaspoon, slit green chilies 4 to 5, ginger juliennes 1 inch piece, Kashmiri chili powder half teaspoon, salt to taste, garam masala 1 teaspoon, oil 5 tablespoons, water 3 and a half cups. Let's get started. First wash the dried chana or chickpeas under running cold water and soak in 4 cups of water. Soak them overnight. They will look like this after soaking overnight. Now drain the chickpeas. Take a pressure cooker and add the soaked chickpeas with green and black cardamom, cloves, cinnamon, mace, black pepper, bay leaves, tea bags, soda and salt. Watch the video till the end to view how you can substitute tea bags. Now add three and a half cups of water. Close the lid and bring to 3 whistles and then allow to let the pressure release on its own. Now open the lid of the cooker. Take out the tea bags and other spices. Check to see if the chickpeas are done. Keep them aside. Heat oil in a large pot. Add half of asafoetida, cumin seeds, 
let the cumin seeds splutter. Add grated onions, let it cook till they are golden brown. Add garlic paste and ginger paste. Let it cook for 2 to 3 minutes, taking care not to burn it. Add tomato paste and chopped green chilies and salt. Let it cook for 3 to 5 minutes by covering and stirring in between. Add turmeric powder, cumin powder, garam masala, coriander powder, armchur powder and Kashmiri red chilli powder. Add 2 tablespoons of water Cover and cook for 3 to 5 minutes Add half cup of boiled chickpeas and crush them. Now add rest of the boiled chickpeas with all the water. Mix everything together. 
add salt. Mix everything together and let it cook for 7 to 10 minutes on low medium heat. In the meantime, let's make the tempering or baghar. Take a small pan with 2 tablespoons of oil. Add rest of the asafoetida. Kashmiri red chili powder. Ginger julians. And slit green chilies. Fry for 30 seconds. Add the tempering over the prepared Amritsari chole. It's time to plate the Amritsari Chola with some kulcha. Garnish with some slit green chilies and fresh ginger julians. Enjoy! Now let's look at the tips and tricks of making Amritsari Chola. Soak chickpeas overnight to get soft chola. To get the dark red color of chola, add 2 tea bags. Substitute of tea bags. Boil 1 cup of water to that, add 1 teaspoon of any kind of dark tea leaves and add that while boiling chickpeas. In this case, reduce the plain water by half cup. Adding soda makes the chickpeas even softer, but this is optional. Use grated onion and tomato. This makes thicker and smoother gravy. You can adjust the water to your liking. If you like a more chunkier chola, then use lesser amount of water. Add garam masala to take the chola to the next level. Health benefits of chole or chickpeas or garbanzo beans. Chickpeas are packed with proteins and fiber and hence keep you full for a longer time which in turn keeps your appetite under control. Chickpeas are a great source of plant-based protein, making them as a good choice for vegetarians and vegans. Chickpeas have low glycemic index, so helps in control of blood sugar levels in the blood, which is great for diabetics. Prevents colon cancer as it promotes the body's production of butyrate, a fatty acid that reduces inflammation and in colon cells. Chickpeas are a great source of magnesium and potassium which boosts heart health. Let's look at the ingredients. The ingredients list is also given in the description box below. Please subscribe to Festive Flavors and click the bell icon to receive new recipe updates. Share it with your family and friends. Please click the like button below if you like the recipe. Also tell us what you think of this recipe in the comment section below. Next time we will come with a new video. Until then, happy cooking. Namaskar.